into the terminal and use the Endar Spire security systems against the Sith. Made it just in time. There's only one active escape pod left. Come on, we can hide out on the planet below. I'm a soldier with Republic, like you. We're the last two crew members left in the Ender Spire. Basil's escape pod's already gone, so there's no reason for us to stick around here and get shot by the Sith. Now, come on, there'll be time for questions later. Good to see you up instead of thrashing about in your sleep. You must have been having one hell of a nightmare. I was wondering if you were ever going to wake up. I'm Karth, one of the Republic soldiers from the Endar Spire. I was with you on the escape pod. Do you remember? Slipping in and out of consciousness for a couple of days now, so I imagine you're pretty confused about things. Try not to worry. We're safe. At least for the moment. We're in an abandoned apartment on the planet of Terrace. 
We were banged up pretty bad when our escape pod crashed, but luckily I wasn't seriously hurt. I was able to drag you away from our crash site in all the confusion, and I stumbled into this abandoned apartment. By the time the Sith arrived on the scene, we were long gone. You don't have to thank me. I've never abandoned anyone on a mission, and I'm not about to start now. Besides, I'm gonna need your help. Terrace is under Sith control. Their fleet is orbiting the planet, they've declared martial law, and they've imposed a planet-wide quarantine. But I've been in worse spots. I saw on your service records that you understand a remarkable number of alien languages. That's pretty rare in a raw recruit. But it should come in handy while we're stranded on a foreign world. There is no way the Republic will be able to get anyone through the Sith blockade to help us. If we're gonna find Bastila and get off this planet, we can't rely on anybody but ourselves. That smack to your head did more damage than I thought. Bastila's a Jedi. She was with the strike team that killed Darth Revan, Malak's Sith Master. Bastila's the key to the whole Republic war effort. The Sith must have found out that she was on the Endor Spire and set an ambush for us in this system. I believe Bastila was on one of the escape pods that crashed down here in Terrace. For the sake of the Republic war effort, we have to try and find her. Bastila is no ordinary Jedi. She has a rare gift the Jedi call battle meditation. Bastila's power can influence entire armies. Through the Force, Bastila can inspire her allies with confidence and make her enemies lose their will to fight. Often that's all it takes to tip the balance in a battle. Of course there are limits to what she can do, but from what I understand of her ability, it requires great concentration and focus to maintain her battle meditation. The attack on the Endar Spire happened so fast she never had a chance to use her battle meditation. Like us, she barely got out alive. Bastila's gonna need our help. Many of Darth Malak's followers can use the dark side of the Force, and the Sith have already killed more than their share of Jedi in this war. Nobody will be looking for a couple of common soldiers like us, and if we're careful, we can move about the planet without attracting notice. A luxury Bastila won't have. She's gonna have half the Sith fleet looking for her. They know how important she is to the war effort. The whole planet is under quarantine. No ships can land or take off. So if Basil's gonna escape Terrace, she's gonna need our help. And we'll probably need hers. While you were out, I did some scouting around. There are reports of a couple of skate pods crashing down into the Undercity. It's probably a good place to start. But the Undercity's a dangerous place. You don't want to go there unprepared, and it won't do Basil any good if we go and get ourselves killed. Good idea. We can use this abandoned apartment as a base. We can probably get some equipment and supplies here in the upper city. Just remember to keep a low profile. I've heard some grim stories about the Dark Jedi interrogation techniques. They say the Force can do terrible things to a mind. It can wipe away your memories and destroy your very identity. But I figure if we don't do anything stupid, we should be okay. I mean, after all, they're, they're looking for Bastila, not a couple of grunts like us. All right, soldier, let's move out. Okay, you alien scum. Everybody get up against the wall. This is a raid. That's how we sit deal with smart mouth aliens. Now the rest of you get up against the wall before I lose my temper again. Hey, what's this? 
Humans hiding out with aliens. They're Republic fugitives. Attack! <laughs> Who are you? What are you doing in here? You can't just come barging into someone's home. You're as bad as that pig Holden. I'll stay out of your way, but you're wasting your time. I don't have anything worth stealing. Look, I know we're trying to keep a low profile, but this kind of attitude will draw attention we don't need. Kuyami juz chikata na patoga ya fulki gokogala jiji. Gawana bot atagwa! Kagidora! Runda di hotonga kun hunka bi. Wana kun bez ching palamule tonking ba nunotak? Tok ning. Chi gratu loda bograshi onion kumba chin tondo mochuba. Loda nita kun. Ita patisa batua kacha tu tong. Bagra sha kun tija ka um. Chuba kaha chopa chata kum juz tak miki grabul mogo. Kachichu ita bodunga. Tolba bank wale oganda naru chuchut. Mogisha punga bola wana chikne. And I can tell you from experience that they aren't any good at all against a simple vibroblade. That's why the Republic has been training soldiers in hand-to-hand -hand and melee combat. 
Ka chi kun ita haldonga, i king kun o pa mulera chi kun. Slimo po donar di haldonga ku hunka be. Tong abog sha um ni na, wanga kun bis king balemura ya. Choni yon tun chi chi ita duan. Achuta, wonga kun bis dolpi kiku. On it. Done. Pudu, tuni rama na pudu, tuni rama na praka donko tsercha, chupa panki. Thank <laughs> you. 